Hey, we're here at Apex 2024. I'm at Texa. And the great thing about being at events like this is to see new things and give you a little preview of things to come. This year, we're giving you a preview of the new IDC6 software, which is coming soon. Now, this is very similar to what you were using before with the IDC5. The navigation's the same, the vehicle coverage is the same, and we still have all the coverage that's available to you using your TXT multi-hub for different environments, including cars, trucks, heavy duty, power sports, marine, anything that comes into your shop, the IDC6 can handle it. Some of the great new features that we're gonna show you is the AI assistance that I like. Now remember, this is not designed to replace your diagnostic abilities. It's only going to give you a little bit of an assistance with known Texa repairs from other technicians and other shops across the country. Let's go ahead and get into what the AI Global Scan is all about. So one of the great new features on this IDC6 software is this AI supporting diagnosis. Now don't confuse it with AI that you are thinking of. This isn't Google we're using for AI support diagnostics. That's not how it works. This is designed by Texa with technician's assistance and OE support as well for real-time fixes that have already been established in the field and to help walk you through a correct diagnosis approach. We're not using Google, let's remember that. So one of the great new things that I like about this is the ability to use an AI, AI support. And right now we can use any car we choose. And we just happen to pull up a Chevy and the dreaded Chevy P0420 code. We just type that in, and here's gonna come up with some possible solutions or known problems with that DTC. You didn't have to input a car, I was just able to look it up to see what could be going on with that DTC. The other thing that I really like about this is when we do a global scan. It's changed a little bit, but it looks a lot like we've seen in the past. If we do a global scan on this Toyota, it's gonna to go through all of the modules, start scanning, and just like that, we get to a screen that's gonna show us all the possible problems that could be with this vehicle. So we ran through the module scan, and right now we've got some for the ABS. As soon as we click down that ABS pump motor control, DTC, we are able to have some information on this. Right here, AI info. So it's gonna tell us what the failure could be, how to diagnose this problem, and we also have some other information that can be clicked on to know more about it. What caused this code to happen, and how can we go ahead and diagnose this correctly? Again, there's a lot of information out here, and don't be confused, this AI diagnostic is here to assist you and not take over what you would normally do as a technician. Keep an eye out, IDC6 will be coming out soon, but it's nice to have a little bit of a sneak preview. Here at Texa, Apex 2024, see you next time.